Hey, this is Tyler with Turf Tech, and today we're at a uh, customer's job site and we're going to be doing some flower bed edging. As you can see from looking at these flower beds, they haven't been maintained in a while, so we're going to be using our bed opener blade to uh, cut open these flower beds. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to come through with the uh, 1305 bed edger with our opener blade on it. We're going to edge right along the side of our beds here, create a nice defined uh, brand new bed edge. After that, we're gonna come back with our string trimmer and, and just zip a line along the side of the flower bed edges to really dress them up. That really helps to, to make the uh, flower bed edges pop. After that, we're gonna rake the material into the flower bed. We're gonna hit it with weed killer, and then we're gonna mulch to finish everything off, and it's gonna look fantastic. So we're gonna run you through the basic controls on the tractor here. And starting off, we have our uh, throttle control. So. When you're ready to start the tractor, you move the throttle control all the way up into the choke position. You'll pull on your recoil. As soon as the machine starts, you move it back into the run position. And once you're ready to shut the engine off, you move it down into the stop position. That'll immediately shut off the engine. Now moving on to the right-hand side of the tractor, we have our hydrostatic control drive. So this is what's controlling the transmission on the tractor. And in order to go forward, it's as simple as squeezing this lever here and reverse you grab this lever up here. And when you let off of both controls, the tractor goes into neutral automatically. Moving over to the left-hand side of the tractor, we have our clutch control here. Now, the clutch doesn't control the transmission. The clutch actually controls the blade drive on the side of the edger. So when you're ready to start edging, you engage your clutch first, and then you'll come up to your uh, lift handle here, and you'll lower the blade into the operating position. So that's gonna lower it down into the flower bed. And of course, it's important to remember to always engage your clutch first. When you're ready to stop edging, lift the blade out of the working position into the transport position so it's ready to uh, move from one job site to the next. The other control that we wanna go over here is the swing release. Now, we're not gonna be utilizing the swing release today because we're just having our, uh, our bed opener blade that we're using. So whenever we're using our bed opening blade, we want to keep the arm tucked against the side of the tractor rather than pivoting it out. That's where it's going to uh, work properly. And now the uh, final control that we want to go over is our blade depth gauge wheel. So our depth gauge wheel here is controlled, it controls the maximum depth that you're cutting with this pin system. So it's a very simple system that uh, controls the maximum cut. Right here we're set at about two inches, but most most landscapers, uh, most customers are gonna be looking for a bit of a deeper edge. So we move it up to the top here, and that's actually gonna be our, our maximum depth. So this wheel is what controls the blade depth. And at our top position here, it is as deep as it'll possibly go. Of course, if you have any questions on how to control the tractor, you know, what are the best operating practices, you can always feel free to give us a call at Turf Tech. As you can probably tell while we were edging here, we were hitting a lot of rocks in this flower bed. I mean, this is clearly rocky ground around here and uh, it hasn't been maintained in a while, so we were hitting some rather large rocks. But the important part is that, you know, we have an incredibly tough tungsten carbide tip blade. Blade weighs about 15 pounds and it's spinning at about 1500 RPM. So you can see here where we hit rocks, we're actually splitting those guys in half. And uh, it doesn't damage the machine at all, uh, so it's really tough for uh, when you're getting into these rocky situations.
right, so we finished up our mulching here. Uh, so we're ready to move on to the next job. Homeowner's happy. And um, if you have any questions about the TurfTech uh, bed edger, please do give us a call. Uh, thanks for watching.